Yeah, it's six. What is it, 605? Oh my god. Yeah. Did it go faster? It's amazing. I thought it was closer to three or four. I'm thinking one more hour. It's always so gratifying when groups have six. Oh my god, I thought it was midnight. It's only six. You're gone. Okay. I have to call one. So bring in some amusement. Bring in a lot of real gratitude and appreciation for yourself that you're taking your time and your resources and your energy and applying it to helping other people but to giving to yourself. And appreciate that you're the kind of person that's enjoying pushing your boundaries and opening to new explorations. And that you're the kind of person who can put up with all this ambiguity and no set answers. Or few set answers. And just appreciate that that makes you a pretty small percentage of people on the planet. Which doesn't make anybody else inferior. It's just something worth appreciating about yourself. And imagine above your head a ball of energy is forming. Unlike any energy you've ever been aware of before. Just have the intention that an energy is forming over your head. It's an incredible spiritual energy. It will nurture you, protect you, bring out the best in you, and will totally support you in this next phase of your life, whatever that is for you. And maybe it'll help you with your clarity and your creativity and help you to find support from other people. Help you with positive synchronicities so the doors just open. So that if any door closes, at least two more doors open leading to wonderful futures. And let that ball of energy help you connect with your spiritual information and your spiritual nature. To help you to really deeply understand and get and experience that you are a big, powerful spiritual being who's here to have incredible experiences on this planet. And some of those incredible experiences may be mundane and some of them may be unique. It doesn't matter as long as they're for you. And imagine that the energy of infinite love is coming down and entering your heart chakra. And as it does, you might imagine that your heart chakra begins to tingle or feel warm or just feels really nice. As it comes into your heart chakra, it may hit some old energies and there might be a tiny bit of discomfort. That's okay. Just give permission for infinite love to come into your heart and even into your physical heart. That's right. And since your blood is moving through your physical heart, every time your heart pumps, it's pumping infinite love throughout your blood supply, throughout your body. So infinite love is coming into your heart, into your blood. And every time your heart beats, infinite love is being sent to every cell of your body. From the top of your head, down to the tips of your fingers, down to your pelvic area, knees, ankles and feet, and the bottom of your feet. And as more and more love pours into you, it starts to come out into your aura around you. 
into your energy field around you so that you're filled and fulfilled with love and that you're actually now forming a cocoon of love around you to support you and nurture you. And let that cocoon get brighter and stronger and let every cell in your body vibrate with the energy of infinite love. And as you keep this cocoon of energy around you, this cocoon of love, create a second cocoon of love. It goes out from you, filled with infinite love, includes everybody that you care about in the world. Whether or not they care about you. So as infinite love comes into your heart and creates your own individual cocoon of love around you, this second cocoon of love includes everybody you care about. All powered by infinite love. Good. And now let's create a third cocoon of love and let it go out and let it surround the entire planet so that the whole planet is enveloped in this third cocoon of infinite love. So you have your individual cocoon of love nurturing and protecting you, supporting you, healing you. You have a second cocoon of love that unites you with everybody you care about. You have a third cocoon of love that unites you with everybody on the planet. And I'd like to suggest to your unconscious minds that if you like this process, your unconscious minds can do it every night when you sleep. So that every single night when you sleep, part of the time can be spent filling with infinite love, creating your individual cocoon of infinite love, creating another cocoon of infinite love that unites you with everybody you care about, creating a third cocoon of infinite love that connects and unites you with the entire planet. And that can happen easily and naturally while you sleep soundly and deeply. So that every time you sleep, part of the time is very, very healing, nourishing, just wonderful for you. Now if you're driving later this evening, I want to ask your unconscious minds to automatically make sure that you drive safely and alertly. And have your unconscious minds go ahead and ground your root home, send a grounded symbol, or, or ground your root wherever you're going, so that however you're driving is grounded, is safe, you're surrounded by safe drivers and polite and nice drivers, you're invisible to the police unless you need their help, you're enjoying the trip, and it's all safe and alert, and then later tonight, when it's time to go to sleep, then you can really go back to processing. Your unconscious mind will review the day that it does automatically. It will take the learnings you got from today and the insights and the ahas and it will make them stronger and deeper and integrate them more into your personality. That you automatically are more aware of your spiritual knowing and you just know things. That that can be more and more automatic that you just know so that you're making less decisions and just knowing more. Or another way to say that you're making your decisions based on the incredible information that's available to you. So those are just some suggestions. And then you might want to stretch and move a little bit. Oh, I want to do one close-up of your sweet face. That is so precious. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry, that is looking at me just glowing. Sweet, 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 sweet.